going to update? No, because I feel bad. Don't you want to tell them that you you shut down Sam? <laughs> I didn't shut it down. Captain's vlog. So we've been here. How many days have we been here? Five. Five days. So we're letting Jessica navigate. Good morning. Let's see if she knows where she's going. Let's see if she knows where she's going. <laughs> nah, you're going right. What kind of donut did you get? The huge? Yeah. This is called the quad. Because it's, it's the fitness donut. one. Not because there's four things on it. Anyway, we're up. up this is pure we're up in Adam early this morning. This is pure glutton. We woke up at six. I'm so full. We woke gluttony. up at six. Because we're going on a boat and David needed to eat breakfast. This is why he works out twice a day. Because he likes to eat. Right, we'll see on myself. the boat. Sunscreen, this is our sunscreen bag. Extra sunscreen. This is where I keep all of my money, tampons, batteries, AirPods, things I don't really want to get wet. Okay. Ashley. Hi. <laughs> oh, welcome to Barbados. <laughs> Can you follow her channel? I'm winning. Babe, who's winning? Are you fucking kidding me? You're, you're such a loser. Shit out. Guys, these scallops, stunning. Papa got a steak and a lobster, and we got truffle fries, mac and cheese, Brussels sprouts, and mashed potatoes. Yummy. Are you gonna update? No, because I feel bad. Don't you wanna tell them that you you shut down Sam? <laughs> I didn't shut it down. Let's Bye, resort. I was in a Facebook group. Good it's thing. Called, Good thing this place is gonna turn into a parking lot after you. It's called Sandals Barbados Fan Group. Okay, keep going. You don't have to keep looking. I got you. Okay, and I've been following this for like two years at this point because our honeymoon got postponed. It was the whole thing. Everyone in the group like raves about how this was the most luxurious, amazing resort. So I had very. By the way, she's sporting a tot, a top that I tied. This. Daisy Dukes, and her white this um, sandals, and that. That money bag, green bag. Anyway. And her matching earrings. Okay, so, right babe, I've been hyping this place out for like, yeah. two years. I was like, this is gonna be like, phenomenal. And it just wasn't that, like, we've talked about it, like, everyone's kind of rude here, and for the amount of money we paid, we were just a little disappointed. So, today, after- Our boat trip on a catamaran. Our boat trip was great, it wasn't that, it was, we were waiting for room service for like three hours. 
Oh yeah. And then we had our reservation For, tonight at nine. What do you call the box mac and cheese again? Like fucking craft mac and cheese. Craft mac and cheese. Meanwhile, our room service from last night is still outside our our door. Like didn't get picked up. We got one towel, like refurbished, refurbished this morning. Whatever. You did read that they're short on towels. So. Oh, and we had a reservation tonight, so we went to go change it, and she was like, "We're too busy. Come back later." And the messed up part is. And that happened like. Wait, times. wait, wait! But here's the here's you know what? Here's another thing I just thought about. They kept our even after we said we they, we canceled. They kept it open. Right. It was. Which like is a whole, which, It was like a plethora of things. Which worked in our benefit, but in a negative note, if we did really cancel. Somebody else could have gotten that. Somebody could have got that reservation. So it was like a week long of like disappointments for what I thought was gonna be a very like, I don't think we're gonna like roll out the red carpet, have all these like fun honeymoon things planned. That just like wasn't the case. They like treated us like, you can't even talk to anyone because you're so busy. You can't even get a clean towel. Hey anyway, honey, why don't you make your way up? So I went out to the Facebook group and I left a review. Honey, And everyone is honey. validating my experience. Oh, my feet hurt. Because I feel validated that I am not the only one that had this experience. I think it was awful because it wasn't. It just wasn't like to my ex. It wasn't like up here. Like I thought it was gonna be. Is the door open? Yeah. Why? That's weird. Wait, that's weird. Why yeah. The door open? Wait, the wall continues. Our door is open. Yeah. Is there a thing here? I feel like that's... Oh no, they turned down the thing. That's weird. Yeah, but they left the door open. Did you close the curtains? Go check out there. Yeah, they locked it, but they shouldn't have left the door open. Yeah, babe. I got all my shit in here. I'm checking this thing. I wanted to make sure the YSL was open. Look, when you do something, look behind you. Make sure you, because that's just common courtesy. That's just ridiculous to me. I'm sorry. Your laptop, my watches. Yeah, that's crazy. No, your laptop was out. Not that anybody here would do anything like you, but you just never know. My donuts, quick. See if my donuts are still there. We're gonna hit the hay. Oh, to me. After an eventful night. Yeah. Babe, last day tomorrow. Good. <laughs> Our morning breakfast walk. Favorite spot. Okay, we're leaving the beach. What did you think, honey bun? I had a great time. You had a great time, except you didn't like dinner. We did a photo shoot. We didn't like our lunch, per usual. They forgot David's burger. <laughs> they basically forgot your entire burger. They gave him a, a dry bun, a patty. I'm a little tipsy. I had a quesadilla. Pretty delicious. Anyway, we're going to get iced coffee. Then we're gonna go back to the room. I'm pretty sure I got some poisoning on my face. Do you see how red this is? Probably not. I'm almost certain I have some poisoning. Babe, what are you doing? Okay, how many service here? We're playing the game. Not sure the ball is gonna play. David wants to play a game. What game do you want to play? We're playing two things we love about each other. Handsome. Naturally. Nice cheekbones. You're a good person. And you treat me really nicely. Now that those shenanigans are over. She makes a lot of money. <laughs> I knew you were ready for the money. This is the real reason. She has a good heart. 
Um, it's just pretty. I'm pretty sure that's two reasons. Pretty is like me over. What are we gonna go do now? We're gonna, Western. we're gonna go back to their room. I'm gonna take a nap. And David's gonna watch his Western. It's our last night here. I'm getting ready for dinner. I'm pretty much ready to go home, to be honest. I mean, we had a lovely time. Me and David had fun together, but we definitely wouldn't recommend this resort where we stayed. Honestly, it was really, it was really expensive. Like definitely the most expensive all-inclusive resort that I've ever stayed at. So we were like, whatever, we'll, we'll splurge for our honeymoon and it'll be fine. And like, I don't know, my expectations because it was so expensive were like up here and everyone like raves about this place. So I was like, whatever, it's worth a splurge. And it just has not been great. Like the staff has been not great. A lot of the restaurant workers are really rude. Um, there was a restaurant that I really wanted. It was a Hobashi restaurant. So we went down to make a reservation and the lady at the front desk booked us the wrong restaurant. So we got to the hibachi restaurant and it was, there wasn't a, like, we were like, oh, we're here for the hibachi. And like, there was no hibachi. Like it was a completely wrong restaurant. We went down a few times to the front desk to like ask questions and they were always like, we're really busy, come back later. Like, it just seems like they're very busy. And like, we thought this would be this like luxurious, special honeymoon vacation where they would like treat us like royalty and like I guess that's what I was envisioning in my mind and it really just seems like they they're way too busy to like cater to anyone specifically and everything's like really rushed restaurants like run out of really simple things like we came back yesterday to room service left us one towel there's like a towel shortage um room service also left our door open all night while we were out like thankfully our stuff was fine but like I have my laptop here my money like I have like things in here like to leave the door open like what the hell it's just like not what we not what we thought it was gonna be so we're leaving tomorrow probably aren't gonna come back here honestly I don't think we're, we would go to any we were at the sandals or Royal Barbados I don't think we would stay at any of the sandals to be honest after this we stayed at the secrets Riviera Maya in Cancun and that was like what I thought this was gonna be. It was a quarter of the price of this one and we had such a better time there. So we would definitely go back to Mexico, specifically Secrets. I just think Sandals maybe has gotten a little bit too big. This is like the popular resort and they just maybe can't keep up with it. So anyway, we're going to our last hurrah dinner. Now we were supposed to go to a nice dinner that we couldn't book. So I have like a nice outfit that I never got to wear. But now we're just going to like a little regular restaurant. So I don't know if my outfit's too, too much. So we're gonna try it on and give it a whirl. We decided not to go with the dress because it was a little aggressive. Put this cute little jumpsuit on instead. A roadie. We're at our last dinner. Dinner and a show. But we got a bad view. David's making a reel. David's scouting picture location. What a good little husband. Oh, no, you picture now. It's 10 30. We just finished dinner. It took an hour and a half, but it's fine. Should we pack tonight? Good. I think we're going to pack tonight. The final hurrah. <laughs> it's the final walk to breakfast. 
little foggy. We look like we're in the jungle. I'm ready to go home. I feel like Same. shit. I've eaten and drinking everything in the world. Same. Oh my god, how foggy is this? Our final meal. Are you sad or excited? I'm sad because there'll only be another year so I can eat this. Eat like a piggy? No, my like breakfast is over. David loves the breakfast. I went white, hashy in the eggs, my stomach hurts. That's it. The final hurrah. Then we gotta go pack and go to the airport. Okay. I just want to say thank you for the best time you've ever. This is time you're number two, and it's just as amazing as the first one. You always plan to do an exceptional amount uh, of excellent. You're a great one. I love you so much. Final goodbye, babe. Nothing outside.